a heads up about the sensitive nature of this next story. Many of us shop online and it's not unusual to have packages showing up at our door on a regular basis. But a woman says she was shocked when she opened up a large box which contained something she claims she didn't order. Here's Pat Foran and Consumer Alert. Pat. Nathan and Michelle, the woman from northern Ontario says she was totally surprised to get a delivery of more than 1,000 condoms. Even though she didn't order them, Amazon said she still had to pay the bill of almost $700. This is the box that we received. Joelle Engelhardt occasionally orders from Amazon, but says she definitely did not order 30 boxes of Trojan condoms. The resident of Chapleau, Ontario, says she did get an email saying they were on the way. We um, automatically assume that the email was a scam um, because it's, it's not anything remotely near what we would purchase or what we would need. When the package arrived, Anglehart's husband was in the hospital recovering from an illness, and she says they have no idea why the box containing over 1,000 of them showed up. We really can't understand what exactly took place um, and, and why we received the package at our house. They became more concerned when Amazon billed their credit card $670. Anglehart says she was told because they were personal items, they could not be returned and she had to pay up. We clearly did not order this package. It's a lot of money. Cyber experts say the delivery is similar to a brushing scam. That's when vendors send packages to unsuspecting customers to boost their ratings with fake reviews. In this case, Anglehart was charged, which means her account may have been hacked. There's definitely a rise in the incidence of these types of fraud. If you receive an unwanted package, notify the retailer, attempt to identify the sender, check your account for recent orders, change your account passwords, and protect your identity. Anglehart had been trying to get a refund for the past four months. When CTV News contacted Amazon, a spokesperson said, it's our commitment to make things right for customers and to hold bad actors accountable. Amazon secured the customer's account and their money has been returned. Anglehart was relieved to get her $670 back. Thank you, CTV. We love you guys. She was also told she could keep the items, though she's not sure what she'll do with them. But I would perhaps try to advertise that I am selling condoms at a discounted price. And there is also a porch pirate angle to this type of scam. Criminals may order items using your account and then try to be there when the delivery shows up to steal the packages at your door. On your side, I'm Pat Foran. If you have a consumer story idea, email us at alert at ctv.ca.